Hello everyone! So finally getting around to doing the intro for the video on my latest project which I actually finished about a month ago but putting the video together and then getting around to doing this little video intro for it because I didn't really make a lot of video while I was working on it. Um, that takes some time so um, I'm just getting around to posting this. Anyway, um, if you like watching my videos and if you're interested please um, subscribe to my channel or leave a comment or something so that I know that you guys want to see what I'm doing because it does take quite a bit of time putting videos together and stuff so um, let me know what you think and it, it it gives me motivation to keep doing the videos otherwise um, it takes me a month to put it together like this one anyway um, if you want to see how I did these shelves just stay tuned to the rest of the video and you can see how I did it. Basically this wall, as you'll see by the photo, was just stacked with shelves and crates where I was trying to organize stuff and not really getting very, not doing a good job of organizing. So um, I'd known all along that I wanted to build shelves here because it's just a blank wall six feet this way and eight feet high. So, um, building shelves here to me just seemed like the most natural thing to do and it holds a lot of shoes in this master closet anyway um stay tuned to the rest of this video and you'll see how i met, how i built them this was a pretty easy project just very monotonous because it was like measure cut install measure cut install for 27 of these shelves um anyway Thanks for watching and have a great day. Cheerio. Cutting the first vertical board, which was shorter than the other three. And then the next three boards that were eight feet high, propped up against a board on the floor to match the height of the baseboard. I ended up cutting the baseboard away and reattaching it around the shelf. Here we go with the measure, cut, install part. I measured each board separately. They were all pretty much the same, but just to make sure. I attached the back support pieces into the stud. First row of shelves done. As you can see, they're higher for boots. I repeated for the rest of the 27 shelves and then added a little trim to cover the edge of the plywood. Then it was caulk, paint, install, caulk, paint, install. Um, that was quite time consuming. And then reinstalling the baseboard and then putting the shoes up. And the finished product, I'm really happy with, turned out to be a lot of storage space for me. Thanks for watching.